Good morning, Kaufman. Today is Friday, January 24th. I'm Jenny. And I'm Amanda, and you're watching Kaufman Live. It's a busy weekend for sports, so let's head over to Nate. Hey, Rocks. It's Nate with your sports announcements. Tonight we take on our rivals up the road in Route 33 Rumble. All of our sports have had some very interesting matchups against them this year. Here's a preview to get you fired up. As always, the games are a country out. Girls are home and guys are away. Don't be late for tip-off. Beat Marysville. Swim and dive team both have OCCs this weekend. Dive will be at New Albany and swim will be at Worthington. Rowdy Rocks, come out and make a splash. Calling all hockey hooligans. Come out to the game tonight against Jerome and it's a fundraiser. Do it for Darren. For more information, let's hear from Mark and Sue, assistant captain of the hockey team. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Sue here with co-captain Mark. Can you tell us anything special that's happening tonight at the game? Yeah, tonight's a huge matchup for us as it always is when a Kaufman sports team plays Jerome. But more importantly, it's for a great cause. All proceeds from our game tonight are going to the Do It For Darren Foundation. This foundation raises mental health awareness and is run after Darren Richardson, who was 14 years old when she tragically took her life. I personally knew Darren, and uh, this is a very important cause to raise mental health awareness for any kid going through what she went through before she ended up taking her own life. That's awesome. Is there um, a special, special theme for tonight's game? Yeah, tonight's going to be a purple out. Purple is Darren's favorite color, and it's also the color to represent mental health. So it's going to be a great game, and I'd love to see as many people there as possible to support this great cause. Thanks, Mark. It's tonight at 7 p.m. at the Chiller. Don't forget to go and wear purple. And they'll also be auctioning off Columbus Blue Jackets apparel. So go out and have a good time. Thanks. Back to the desk. Next week is the Sadie Hawkins dance. Don't forget to vote for one girl and one guy from your grade. Voting ends tomorrow. Any senior interested in ordering a senior hoodie or t-shirt should stop by the Rock Shop for an order form. Discount tickets for this weekend's show, Night of the Living Dead, will be on sale today in the Commons during lunch. Discount tickets are $3 at lunch only, but at the door they're $5. Come and see the original zombie show this weekend tonight or tomorrow in the PAC at 7 p.m. Lit Mag is accepting submissions. Enter your writing or art to, ma to the magazine, and on top of potential publication, be entered into a raffle for a $10 gift card of your choice. Drop off submissions in the folder outside B270. The state math test will be held Saturday morning, February 22nd at OSU. This one hour $5 test covers topics through pre-calculus and highest scores win cash and a chance to compete at Capital University for prizes. If interested, ask your teacher for a flyer or see Mrs. Co-Watch in room A130. Registration ends January 31st. Seniors, have you been accepted to college and need funds for, to pay for it? Be sure to review the scholarships on Naviance. Over 40 scholarships are offered to our seniors by clubs, parent groups, schools, and sports teams in Dublin. Don't miss your chance to apply in guidance. Local scholarship applications will be available on February 3rd. If you wish to audition for the spring musical, see Mr. Stowell in the Little Theater, room B-158. Lead role auditions will be this Tuesday. If you are not auditioning for a lead role, chorus auditions will be Monday. Did you make a resolution to get more involved at school? Join Multicultural Club to meet new friends and open up your world. We will meet today in B263 to plan our quarter. See Mrs. Damani for details. 
Medical Club will meet Monday after school in Mr. Carpenter's room A227. Donald Mazzari, an admission representative from the Chamberlain College of Nursing, will be holding a workshop to build awareness in medicine and how to pick the best college to match your personal need. Anyone is welcome to stop by. D20 Club will meet today after school in Mr. Fitch's room. The annual Teen Institute retreat is coming up next week. Current and prospective TI members are invited to attend. Forms and a $5 registration fee should be turned in today by guidance. Current TI members interested in presenting a keynote speech at the retreat, please con contact Dr. D or Mrs. Murnix for more information. And now over to Jonah with the forecast for the weekend. Hey Kaufman, the wind chill warning has been extended all the way through next Wednesday. There will be extreme cold weather moving in next week. The high on Tuesday likely to be no higher than zero. And there is a very high probability of having at least a two hour delay that day relative to this week's cold weather incidents. The uh, wind chill that morning expected to be around negative 25. And that's all I've got for you today. Now back to the desk. It's almost time for scheduling, so for more information about the Dublin Business Academy, check out this video. The Dublin Business Academy is a course offered to all three high schools that takes place in Dublin Jerome. Um, it's a three period course that consists of learning about the business world the first period and then running an actual business the second and third period. We actually operate a screen printing machine that was specialized in doing apparel such as t-shirts, sweatshirts, sweatpants, shorts, essentially anything you want a logo on we can do for you. Regardless of your schedule, we could easily fit the DBA into it because we offer it first, second, and third period along with fourth, fifth, and sixth period, so it's easy to manipulate through your schedule. The unique experience about the Dublin Business Academy is that you get to exper experiment with every single section of a real business. We have a marketing, a management, an accounting, and production group that we rotate every nine weeks of the year. That's all the announcements we have. Have a great weekend.